In Crime Stoppers, a reminder of the incident and mass in the, and the victims in a mass shooting from September as the reward for information has now soared past $20,000. Greg Glover has details. David, on September 25th, seven women were shot, the youngest of them age 14. Before sunrise, two had died of their injuries. Investigators are still working to find who's responsible. They're hoping a massive reward fund will encourage someone to be brave and come forward with a tip. It's important for everybody to get this person who shot into a large crowd off the street. It was Saturday night, September 25th. Nearly 100 people had gathered in the 1000 block of Grove Street celebrating a reunion. Around 10 p.m., gunfire pierced the darkness. Labricia Dews and Kaniqua Hughes were both shot and killed. Five other females were also shot. They were transported to a local hospital um, with significant injuries. It was just by chance all the victims were female. Dews was 37. Hughes was 21. Those injured range in age from 14 to 26. That's very young to not only die in our community, but be shot and killed in our community. So it's very important that we provide justice for this family. Police are lacking a few pieces to their investigative puzzle. These two victims were not the intended target. We believe that the suspect arrived at the location and also left on foot. But we do believe that there was a nearby waiting vehicle for that suspect to leave. Have you heard anything about that vehicle or someone who may have driven the shooter around that night? Up to $1,000 reward cash is waiting. Also, we know that people were out there. We know that people saw what happened. We know people know who the suspect is or suspects. Crime Stoppers guarantees you'll remain anonymous. No one will know you provided information. You'll be issued a case number you'll keep right up through collecting your money. This mass shooting has far reaching consequences. The family obviously is affected. That local community in the west side is obviously impacted, but it goes beyond that. That includes first responders. Those other people that were not even out there initially, but saw the aftermath of what happened. It impacts everyone. In addition to that $1,000 Crime Stoppers cash, the mayor's office, along with community groups, have put up an additional $20,000 towards the reward. Collect all that cash if you provide information that leads to the arrest and conviction of just who pulled the trigger back in September. Call Crime Stoppers 698-3333. Now up to $21,000 is on the table, and we will never ask you for your name. David.